Gaza's Ministry of Social Affairs organized Sunday afternoon a sit-in protest in front of the United Nations headquarters in solidarity with three Palestinian children who were burned to death on Friday evening. Their deaths occurred after their home in the Ashata refugee camp in Western Gaza City caught fire from a candle. Medical sources identified the victims as three-year-old Yusra, two-year-old Rahaf, and seven-month-old Nasser al-Hindi. Neighbors said the fire completely damaged the family's house, located in one of Gaza City's poorest areas. The fire also seriously wounded the bereaved mother and her elder son, Muhannad, the only one she could drag out of the blaze. A seven-month-old child, I couldn't drag him. Oh my God, their bodies were distorted. Their bodies caught the fire. I could barely drag their brother to his feet. I couldn't drag the other three. They were burning. The horrific incident has sparked a local criticism of Hamas policies in the Gaza Strip, with ongoing power outages that can extend up to 18 hours a day. The majority of residents accused Hamas of using large amounts of the fuel sent to Gaza's lone power plant for lightening the underground tunnels used for resistance brigades. We took our five children out to play. When we came back home, my wife asked me to bring some macaroni for dinner. While I was on my way to the grocery shop, one of my neighbors phoned. He told me that my house was burned and that my kids were burned too. I ran back home. I found that the ambulance had taken the kids to the hospital. The house was completely burned too. I went to the hospital and I was told that my kids were burned to death. A grueling war of words between Fatah and Hamas over Gaza's power crisis dominated the scene after the incident. Hamas blames the Palestinian Authority for imposing attacks on Gaza's fuel imports. Fatah says Hamas has prevented the unity government from working in Gaza and running its affairs. Meanwhile, Gazans are paying the price for the decade-long Israeli blockade and almost 10 years of political rift between the two rival parties. Nuhara Zin, TV, Gaza.